Hi guys, this is Tiger from Robotic. Uh, in previous video, I have showed you the left hand and right hand both screws. And in this video, I just want to show you this. Uh, the reciprocating uh, screw and block. And we also call it a re a reversing uh, screw or and the block because uh, this block comes to the end and then it will uh, reverse uh, the direction uh, automatically. Yeah, you see. Yeah, I don't need to change the direction of the rotating. Uh, so it can uh, Uh, get reverse uh, using the mechanical design. Uh, this one is uh, diameter 10, uh, which is stainless steel type. And I just want, uh, we have bring you, uh, this one is uh, 45 carbon steel, uh, black amortized, and uh, it's diameter uh, 20 millimeter. And this one is big one, is the big one. The diameter is 25. Uh, and uh, also we have other uh, diameter like uh, 40. Uh, so here, is one of the block and here is the uh, screw reversing screw uh, there is a me mechanical uh, design of this type and we just put on uh, put it to sorry this one is the size uh, put it into this and use I uh, use this. We just uh, and then knock it. Okay. After the knock, you just need to turn the screw in one direction. Sorry, you need to too tight or too loose uh, the effect is not good. Yeah, we just get the. Uh, Block locking system, the right uh, tuck we need, and then you can see that uh, the block will reverse automatically. In compared with this uh, left hand and right hand both screw, uh, you know, uh, you need a motor here to control this, uh, but uh, you need to change the direction of this motor uh, for the uh, direction change. That means uh, you, you need a DC, uh, you need a step motor which you can control the uh, direction easily uh, but you can use this kind of reversing uh, screw using uh, AC servo motor
or AC motor. Yeah. You just need the motor. You just need the motor move in one direction. Thanks for watching and see you in next video.